Hey guys, MJ here, back with another video, and yes, it's Mafia Definitive Edition. But before we get into the actual game, I just want to go over uh, just a couple of things before we get started. So if you don't want to kind of listen to that, obviously, yeah, you can skip forward and you can see the opening of the game and all the beautiful graphics. But uh, just a couple of things that I wanted to, to say beforehand. Um, obviously, you know on my channel, I'm going to be bringing you every single trailer that comes out that, of the games that I like. Hopefully, you like them too. Uh, and there's been quite a lot of them recently. So, I haven't been able to get up the content of me like this during the walkthroughs and um, giving you the, the game news as well on my channel. I, I try and do videos where I sit down and uh, just try and, you know, give you what's going on in the gaming world. Um, like I'm doing with the FIFA videos and stuff like that. But um, yeah, obviously lately that's not been happening too much. Um, so, you know, obviously as it gets further and further um, into the year, you know, you've got all these games coming out like literally one week after another. And it's, it's pretty hard to keep up just like by myself, just playing them let alone actually recording them, editing them, and then getting them up onto YouTube. So, yeah, it's <laughs> it's obviously pretty difficult right now. Um, so what I've de kind of decided on doing is just basically giving you guys like the opening of the games. So at least you get to see like the opening of the game or a little bit of me playing the, that one game. Um, just to just to show off the gameplay, just to show that game and see if you like it, and maybe my first impressions of it, and you know a little bit bit like that, rather than giving you like literally the full game uncut, like well maybe a little bit cut, but like <laughs> you know literally like all the way through from part one all the way like maybe even like some of these games you know like part 50 um which even uploading you know i upload every single day like if i upload like freaking you know that's like 50 50 episodes like 50 days which is just like ah uh, you know like 30 days in a month you know you, you know what i mean it's it gets gets ridiculous um, you can't really do that for a whole you're spending my, maybe like a whole month just uploading that one game and then you know there's maybe two three four other games coming out and then you've got to go on to that one um, and then by the time you've got on to the next one another game's come out and that get that, that video is probably not going to get as much views on it because you know that game's kind of old now you know people have seen the opening people have seen things even this video right now where i'm going to show you the opening of the game is delayed it's get because the game's already out you know what i mean like i'm getting this up later than what it needed to be up so yeah everything is kind of behind everything gets delayed because there's just so much right now in gaming the new consoles are coming out um, you know, yeah, I could go on and on and on, um, but obviously you want to get <laughs> into and seeing the Mafia game, um, that's what you're here for, um, yeah, <laughs> I feel like I've probably rambled on as long enough for this video as it is, so, but just so you can kind of get the, the feel for the situation, yeah, it's fun being a YouTuber, you know. <laughs> uh, yeah, all this editing, all these uh, decisions to be like made on what videos to go up and when to put them up, and yeah, it, um, just yeah. <laughs> um, anyway, let's get into it. Smash the like, subscribe if you're new to the channel. Hope you enjoy it. Um, yeah, let's go.
I've already seen kind of bits of this from like the trailers. It's been a while since I played this game, like the original, so I can't sort of comment too much on like, oh that looks better, oh that, oh, that part looks better. But obviously, yeah, the graphics look pretty damn good. There we go. It's Tommy. Thomas Angelo, Detective Norman. You alone. <laughs> no self-respecting badges coming in here unless it's the health inspector. What can I get you? Ah, just the coffee. Thanks. Dip your beak. No, thanks. Suit yourself. So, you yeah. said on the phone you might have a proposition for me. That's right. Well, if you're looking to set up a gravy train, you called the wrong cop. I'm not looking for any uh, associates. Good. Because I'm on the nut. Can't even pay for the coffee. But I got plenty to trade. Let's hear it. How long you been in town? Three years. Caught my teeth in Empire Bay. Well, they handed you the Morello case. Right out of the gate. That's what the paper says, ain't it? And what's it to you? Tough break. Case must be getting pretty cold by now. Or you got something might warm it up. Yeah, I might have some. And what's my end of the deal? Uh, you want money? Some sort of immunity? None of that. I got people I need to protect. Ah, families. Always the Achilles heel, ain't it? So who you got? A sick ma or a wife and a litter of kids? Wife and daughter. And no one else to watch your back, I'm guessing. Wouldn't be here otherwise. Pity that. I always said a man needs friends if he's going to survive in this world. Yeah. Well, in my world, it's the other way around. No surprise there. Look, I can't promise anything for your family, not until I hear what you're trading. So, are you talking? Or are you just killing time before they come for you? You think I'm on the run? <laughs> oh, I know it, Tommy. Jesus, look at you. <laughs> Surely gassed. You haven't slept for days. And your neck's got to be aching from all that looking over your shoulder you're doing. No, the way I figure it is you got someone powerful mean on your tail and they ain't giving up until you end up in the river. And you walk out that door without me, we both know you're not making it five steps. Boss. Yeah, you stick around, you tell me your story, and maybe you got a shot at living long enough to walk that girl of yours down the aisle. Either way, it looks like I'm buying you a cup of coffee. 
Christ, I don't know how everything got so balled up. No one ever sees the hair pen until it's too late. But you didn't get handed a heater in the nursery, did you? No. I was a cab driver back in 30. There you go. I mostly drove nights, because the money was better. It was at the end of one of those shifts. When I first met Polly and Sam. Oh, shit! <laughs> I knew it. I got a gun pointed at you. They catch up, we're dead. But you don't get to walk go, away. Go, 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 go. I don't want any trouble. Well, you got trouble. Drive. How the hell they know oh, we'd wow. be there? I've got the Doesn't realistic steering. You just guys. gotta lose them. Uh, how many cars we got following? One for now. But there'll be more. Hold tight. I'm gonna try something. Oh, well. Who were those guys? <laughs> You don't get to ask questions. We need to get over the river. Take the Giuliani Bridge. Oh, uh, okay. More of them! Ah, oh, shit! Shit, yeah. I don't remember this. Oh. I know some shortcuts that'll slow them down. Yeah. I don't care oh, how you do it. I don't go too crazy now. You can take a trip over. That was your shortcut? I lost him tonight. Not all of them! These guys really don't like it, do they? Sometimes business partners fall out. It happens. Quit yapping, Polly. The more he knows, the more chance of ah, not seeing the sun come up. I ain't heard a thing, fellas. I mean, these little things here, these are definitely new. Like those little kind of, <laughs> kind of need for speed, isn't it? Like when you crash into something and then they, but there's a little cut to it. Like back in the day, the arse of the car just How many motors were at the exchange? Smash out on that corner. Four, five maybe? And then you know when him, he's gone for more. Sure feels like it. Next time we take more muscle, we should have expected trouble. If the boss hears about this, there'll be hell to pay. They must have sent word out. There's more and more of them. We're not gonna last long unless we're back on our own turf. Let's get back to the neighborhood. Easy. Oh, man. You remember the old school game where you used to be able to crash in a lamppost and they could break and you could keep going? <laughs> Those games were the ones that I freaking used to play when I was a kid. <laughs> I'm used to doing that. Oh. Every car they've got is on our oh, no, ass. I'm trying. Oh, I'm the trying. West Harbor Bridge. Oh, I've done it again. Break these stupid lamp posts. Oh my God, move. I'm 
going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Ah, uh, the bridge is up, ain't it? I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Yeah, we can make it. Yeah. Oh, we ran away. What the hell are we doing? Just sit Go. tight and pray. Oh, I actually remember that bit. I remember that bit. Never done that before. Me neither. Yeah, jump the bridge. Okay, so little Italy. Now. Damn. Your night's right. not Ooh. over. I didn't see this coming. You think he squealed? I think you zip it tight. We talk it through back at the bar. Pull over in front of that bar. It's in the Aries place. Yeah, that's the one. Wait here. What for? You want a little something from the Don or not? So casual, like, yeah, I just done a car chase, bro. Like, a cigarette. Ah, uh, kick back. <laughs> Who's this guy? Oh. Compensation for your services. Any damage to your car. This makes us square. I'm sure it's more than enough. Good. Don Salieri wants you to know that he's very grateful. So if you ever need anything, maybe a loan, or some honest work, don't hesitate to ask. Don doesn't forget his friends. Yeah, okay, thanks. One more thing. This matter stays between us. Anyone asks where you got that money, you want it at poker. The scratches on your car, you swerved to keep from hitting a little old lady. You got it? Nah. What about the booty holes? <laughs> See you around, kid. I really thought when he was like going in his pocket, he's getting out a gun, man. When I opened the envelope, I could have had a heart attack. Enough to fix the cap. <laughs> Nearly enough to buy a new one. I thought about what Sam said about work. I wasn't interested. The money was good, sure, but I didn't want to get in with criminals. Better to be poor and alive than rich and dead. So, right there, back then, I was out. Thing always happened. <laughs> Chapter complete. Guys, there we go. We'll continue. We'll continue a little bit more, I think. After that night with Celieri's guys, I was back working as soon as I could. But it felt different. You get a lot of time with your thoughts when you're a cabbie. And other people's thoughts, too. You there, driver? Yes, ma'am. Are you driving or loitering? Driving, ma'am. Always driving. <laughs> Well, what are you waiting for? So, where to? St. Michael's Church, directly. Oh, careful, yo. please. No, I always that, drive careful. The actual, then you'd be the first. Actually, sh the signs there show you to where to go. I noticed them, but I, like, I didn't realize, like, 
they were like the actual proper directions, but turn that racket off. I can't hear myself think. Oh, right, you gotta hold it down. That's much <laughs> So, church. It's Sunday already. Eyes on the road, please. Stop there, by the park. Here you go, St. Michael's. That'll be 30 cents. 30 cents. The only tip I'll give you is to stop cents. smoking in your vehicle. I felt like I was sitting in an ashtray. Sure, whatever you say. Yeah. That was that was a lot of uh, money back in the day, I guess. Thirty cents. Can't drive without the radio. Better find a new fare. Oh what? New fare? Where are we going? Well, the people on the street just sort of like wave people. White oh, cross he is. Hey. Art gallery. Give me that quick. Sure. Quick I can do. Taking some time out. What's it to you? Not much, just talking. I'm paying you to drive, so do that. <laughs> Look at them out there. The problem with this downturn is that it's made people lazy. Giving them an excuse. The work's not out there, pal. The work is always there. You just have to find it. I get it. You're a busy guy. I don't see so many these days. I saw this crapshoot depression coming. Saw them before the crash. So yeah, I get to be busy. Your busy day is gonna be looking at old paintings? I have a business meeting there with a colleague. Not that it's anything to do with you. If you ever find a real job, then maybe you'll understand. Until then, drive and quit bothering me. Yeah, yeah, I get you. We've got under a minute to get there. I think I can get there in, uh, in enough time. 20 seconds after. Pull up in front of the gallery. Thanks, pal. Here's 50 cents. I'll spend it all at once. 50 cents. I'll try not to. <laughs> to be fair, that was a little bit further than the church, so you know. Every fair today's been a son of a bitch. <laughs> Under the next. <laughs> Are you joking? Oh, wow. Right? We got. Oh, this is like freaking crazy taxi or some shit. Like, what? Crazy? Like, oh my god. This is supposed to be Mafia. Hey, over here. Oh boy, you look like shit. I've been working since five. What's your <laughs> excuse? Moves. Figures. Where are we going? Little Italy, 21st Street. Okay. If I don't tell the cops about the liquor on your breath, you don't tell them when I break the limit. Good deal. Great deal. Got any good fares today? Yeah, some. But never enough of them. Who's got the money for cab rides since the market tanked and it all went to shit, I guess. Only reason I got you taking me places is I'm drunk and don't know better. <laughs> Can't see enough drunk fellas. They're only after the people moving it and selling it. Yeah, but I've seen them go after guys for less. Yes, so if they think they can shake something out of you, they will use any excuse. This city's corrupt as all hell. Sure is. This is WBDS. Up next, some more of the day's favorite music. Mm-hmm. 
Nearly there. Just up here on, on the corner, please. Hey, my cousin has a coffee stand around the corner. Tell him Lucio sent you. Take a break, huh? Thanks. You might just do that. Uh, this is probably where, like, hell breaks loose. <laughs> Car with it. Oh! Whoa, Jesus! Oh. Hey, how you doing, pal? You remember me? Who the fuck are you? Yeah? Oh, shit! Huh? Oh. My brother's a little bent. Shouldn't go help him sell Yari's goons, huh? I'm gonna have to give you a beating. Just so you always remember who runs this town. Make it so you won't do much rocking for a while, eh? <laughs> Look at this guy. I didn't think he'd make it fun. Let's get him. Oh, you gotta be taking a bit. Ah! Quick win. Oh, oh. <laughs> All right, we made it. Look at this. <laughs> How you doing, kid? Dino, Lou. You got business with the Don? Nah, we just trying to talk to that cabbie over there, that's all. That right. Yeah. Well, this here's the Don's favorite driver. So anything you got to say to him, you can say to me. Is that right? Well, I'll tell you something, pal. We ain't leaving empty-handed, that's for sure. Well, then maybe you ain't leaving at all. Ooh. Okay, then. See your boys around. Let's go, Lou. <laughs> Thanks. At least we could do. Come on, let's go say hi to the Don. Don Salieri? Yeah. He's gonna want to hear about this. What do they call you, son? Thomas. Thomas Angelo, sir. Frank told me you ran into some trouble? Yes, sir. My cab got smashed up pretty good. Morello's thugs went after him by the kind of Tommy helping us. This, uh, taxi, that's your livelihood? Yes, sir. I feel a sense of responsibility here. So I'm gonna set you up with a small loan, enough to get that cab of yours fixed up. Well, I appreciate that, sir, but I'm not looking for a handout. Then what are we doing here? I just want a shot at the bastards who wrecked my cab. <laughs> you hear that, Frank? The kid wants my permission to get into a fight. Yes, I heard. Okay, Tommy Angelo. All the Morellas girls hang out at a bar he owns. Paul, you know the place. Sure do, boss. Good. You can ride along with Tommy. There's a lot right next to the bar where they park their cars. 
Go smash up a few tin cans, send Morello a message. He can't rough up hard-working Joes in my neighborhood without getting a black eye. Thank you, Mr. Salieri. I won't let you down. And Tommy, when you get back, we'll talk about what's next for you. No one else knows you here, so tread careful, okay? Sure. The boss finished yet? Nah, you got more time to sit on your ass. Figured that'd be like a Find anything good? Who's the new guy? Yeah, I... Cabby. I'm watching you. We're helping him out. Got it? I get you it. You gonna drive the boss? Nah, you don't lose your job that easy. I hate sitting around. Born as hell. Gail, look. Mi tassista, ricordi? Ah... See. Oh. See. <laughs> Come back later. Oh, made me jump. <laughs> I was like, what the hell? For you, I'm afraid. All right. Anyways, I got places to be. Okay, come through this way. I'll take you to Vinny first. He's a loud mouth, but Frank and Adon have known him since forever. What's he do? We go see him whenever we need to do any, uh, heavy lifting. We make sure we're well healed for when there's trouble. But we gotta go. Long drive back north. I'm going to Vincenzo. Ciao, Polly. Oh, she's gonna sing. <laughs> <laughs> Who's this then? Vinny. This here's Tommy Angelo. We're doing a little job together. All right, good, good. Hey, you just need bean shooters or rods? Nah, we just need something to write off a few cars. Huh. Oh, I got just the thing. This classic should do the trick. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, if the bat don't work out for use, I got a few cocktails here. Ay, ay, ay. Careful with them, though. Don't want to burn off your short ears. <laughs> Good to meet you, Todd. Let me know if Paulie gives you the hard time. I'll straighten him out. Ralphie's in the garage. He's a special kind of idiot, but he's got a way with cars. I don't get how this moron gets interested in her. But I'm telling you, it's like some kind of black magic. Hey, genius! <laughs> get your head out of your ass! <laughs> Fuck it, Polly. You can't, can't, can't just sneak up on a guy like that. Uh, I'm sorry, Ralphie. I'm just busting your balls. <laughs> see, 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 you're still a limping. Guess we got two, 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 two cripples working here. <laughs> Ooh, we ain't nothing alike. You got that, Ralph? Sh 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 show up, Polly. Yeah. Tommy. Tommy Angelo. G good to meet you. Like I said. Ralphie here's a crack deck. Well, you bring him a stolen car, he'll make it yours. Tom and me, we got a job to do. We need some wheels. How about this one, Papa Polly? It, it, it ain't a ha 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 rod, but it, it'll get you across the, to, to town. All right, let's go. You're driving. And don't let me catch you loafing off again. <laughs> One day I'm gonna cut your brake line and <laughs> Oh I don't know what Ralph's trying to pull giving us this motor. 
I want to show you something about the good life, and you're driving something my mom could have bought 20 years ago. If I know Ralph, he probably got it taken out of our yard. Hey, the car's fine. It's good to get a change from the cab. You don't have to be nice about it. Stig's a tin cab! So, was that whiskey back there in the truck? Yep. New supplier. You guys deal in broad daylight? Normally, nah. This was their first drop-off. The cops know better than to come sniffing around our turf. Morello, the guy whose cars you gonna torch? He's got more friends on the force than us. But we're okay, as long as we're careful. An eye over our shoulder. Some of the Canadian whiskey that comes through? You want a bottle? Just ask. We'll keep some back for friends. Ah, I'm no big drinker. I used to tip back bathtub gin most days, but not so much now. That stuff's no good for you. You don't have to go blind now, though. Who us? You got a line in the good stuff. Well, that's good of you. Thanks. Not just the booze it's we supply, fun. Tom. It's the places we deliver to. The dames they got in these places. Best tables, best food, best skirt. Some way to live. Right now, all I want to do is wreck the day of the bastards who wrecked mine. Sure, sure. Besides, all this could get a guy in trouble. Trouble says the guy is about to set fire to Morello's parking lot. <laughs> <laughs> I got you to protect me. It'll go fine. Well, if it don't go fine, try not to let him see your face. Either that, or you hit him so hard they don't remember it. to Morello's turf now. There's some kind of line between his streets and Celieri's streets. Not really. There's always some give and some take. Though in general, we look after Little Italy, and his guys work North Park. And more besides. You're walking on the wrong sidewalk, in the wrong part of town, and you start getting a sense you need to be someplace else. And you can feel it long before they start appearing on street corners to stare you down. A cigarette guaranteed to satisfy, relax, and fortify. Big break blue. Let your Okay, it's go close by. Morello's goons smoke and jaw up front and leave their motors out back. They're some lazy bastards. They put some gorilla on guard duty, but it's always some no-name schmuck. Come on, over here. You gotta sneak in and wreck the cars. Send a message. Sure. Why are you coming with? To see if you get shot. <laughs> okay. You go quiet. You know how to go quiet, right? Yeah, like that. Get over this gate and up onto their roof. I'll go keep their trunk busy while you creep up and jump them from behind. <laughs> Real good at distracting. Hey! What the hell you doing? What do you mean, what am I doing? I mean what I say. What the hell are you doing back there? What? A guy who don't know what idiot told you to keep a lookout here. Dino. Dino told me. Dino? Salieri's got guys all over town trying to get Morello and Black Eye. And Dino makes you card the cars? Listen, fella, who are you? You know Dino? Wait. Now let's get to these cars. Take your bat and start swinging. Okay. Motor really got your pick, huh? No one's driving that again. Ah, oh, crap! Uh -oh. Hey, get away from the car! You missed. Knock him down, oh, turn! You got some kind of death wish? 
Come on, Tom, quick. There's gonna be more of them. Use a Molotov and let's see some flames. Yeah, we got that nice and good. Block her dead. We gotta go. Take Dino's car. How'd you know this is Dino's car? I don't like you, and you got a good car. I'm gonna know where you keep it. Reports of burning vehicles and gunfire in North Park. It's right near Morello's place. Oh, don't bring in the, the wrong people. Let's go. Straight through the gate. We gotta get out of here before the bulls show. Don't let him get away! Drive! Come back, We got cops. So, uh, what do we do? We lose them by driving real fast and getting clear of them. Sounds good. Right now they're pissed. But let's not get them real pissed. The guy's gotten away in North Park someplace. Keep looking, he'll turn up. I think I lost him. Flashing now, you're right. All cars, pursuit is called off. Abandon search and return. Wait, good. Hey. Let's head back and see the boss. I thought Silieri had cops on the books. Some street cops, sure. But Morello's got the chief in his pocket. How'd it feel? Feel good? Of what feel? Taking out the guy. Taking Dino's car. Feel good? Yeah. I guess it did. There's no time like the first time, Tom. Don't get better. You think it's for you? There's life? What's it to you? Hey, I'm just asking questions. I like asking questions. You never got to beat up Dino's pals and take his motor? Nah, stole enough cars to get noticed, I guess. When I got squeezed by the cops, knew never to squeal. And one day I found myself in a yard behind a bar drawn with Vincenzo. Ten years go by and I'm still there. So, I got a suit now and Vinny's an old bastard. <laughs> I always thought that to be in a family you had to have more connections. Your brother or your uncle or... Oh, some guys, sure. Your cousin got made or you like Carlo, whose pop went way back with the Don. That means you get trusted more when you're starting out. There's plenty of us who came in off the street. I'm thinking we get you in front of the boss, then we tip a few. Well, I don't got plans, so... Sure you don't got plans. Plans are to feed Vinny so much booze that Luigi has to roll him out the door again. I'm good with whatever. <laughs> sure you are. to the car I sent you out with. Dumped it. Well, why? It was a boiler. This one's better. A, a, a better car with a, a, a broken window? Fresh air never killed nobody. <laughs> He's still with you then. Somehow, yeah. Hey, boss. It's done. No trouble? Yeah, nothing we couldn't handle, Mr. Salieri. Good, good. Sit down. You see Morello? Nah. But he'll be plenty pissed when his boys tell him what happened. <laughs> He's not going to be able to think straight for weeks. See? That's the difference between me and Morello. I'm a businessman. I do everything with this. Every decision I make, it's what's good for the business and my boys. But Morella is a hothead, and all that anger burns out the brain. And when he gets mad, 
<laughs> you get stupid. You got nothing like that to worry about with Tommy here. He was aces the whole way, boss. I'm glad to hear it. I got a growing business here. We could use a guy like you to help out around the bar. Maybe run some errands. Make sure the bills get paid on time. You up for that? Oh, it'd be an honor, sir. Good. Good. Now, Polly and Sam have already vouched for you. But you need to understand we have a few rules around here, so you listen and listen good. First, no cursing on the premises. There's a million words out there. And the man who needs to resort to fuck this and fuck that is just ignorant or lazy. <laughs> Second, we don't deal in the hard stuff. I don't want any dope fiends in this neighborhood. We'll let Morella poison his own people if that's what he wants. Finally, stay out of trouble with the cops. We only have a few on the payroll. And if you cross the line, the rest will come after you. You understand? Yes, Mr. Salieri. Then I'm going to only ask you for one more thing, Tommy. I don't keep Paulie and Sam around just because they're strong. A lot of guys out there bigger and tougher than these two. And I don't keep Frank on apparel because he's smart. Though he is an artist with the numbers. All these guys in this room, they're here because they have the only thing that matters to me. The only thing that should matter to any of us. You know what that is, Tommy? They're loyal. That's right. Now, you stay straight with me, you're gonna be living the high life, Tom. But you abuse my trust. <sighs> Don Salieri, you won't ever need to worry about me. Okay, then. Welcome to the family. Hey. Excellent. Now I'm starving. Luigi, let's eat. Welcome. A barman Luigi is not much of a cook. But his daughter, Sarah, Maron. Right, guys, we are part of the family now. Got the achievement there as well. <laughs> but I'm going to leave it there, guys. Um, hope you enjoyed it. That was Mafia. Yeah, man. Like, I'm going to be doing, obviously, some more videos for you guys soon. So keep it locked. Make sure you've got that notification bell on. So you're going to get, like, the videos as soon as they go up. 